So in this video, we're gonna go over temporary tattoo. Before you get a tattoo, you wanna make sure you're happy with it. So we're gonna be looking at different things to see what is gonna work. There's a lot of lions and very intricate designs. Like for me, I wanna tattoo my son's name on my arm and I wanna kinda incorporate it around some design. I have a feeling the roses are the butterfly, but I kinda like this whole look. These are smaller ones, as you can see. So these could like, you can also cut these out, of course. But these ones are like you put them back of your neck on the inside of your chest maybe on the leg right smaller ones so let's go through these now what's good everybody so i'm gonna begin some tattoos and the very first thing i wanted to do is i wanted to see what it felt like having tattoos um so if you're one of those people who aren't sure or if you just want to have fun and maybe go to the gym maybe it's halloween maybe it's a party and you want to confuse your family and friends then get some of these. These are super inexpensive and they come with tons and tons of tattoos. I didn't know that you're gonna get so many. So I'm just gonna go and break these down and then we're gonna put some on. Now they do claim that these last a couple of days but then I guess it all depends on you know what you're doing. If you're sweating, if you're on the hot sun, if you're going boating, you probably are gonna wanna um, be more careful um, if you're doing this. But I would say they'll last about two to three days and they'll just peel off basically. Um, so they have different types of designs and with different companies, right? And the concept is pretty much the same. You just put it on your hand. Um, they do say that if you want them to stick better, if you have hairy arms, you want to shave your arms. So for women, it will be easy. On the inside of the arms, it's going to be easy. If you put it on your leg, you probably want to shave it. Um, I'm going to shave it because again, I want to see what it's actually going to look like when I put a real tattoo on. But enough of that. Let's talk about the designs first. So let's go through these slowly. There's a lot of lions and very intricate designs. Like for me, I want to tattoo my son's name on my arm and I want to kind of incorporate it around some design. I have a feeling the roses are the butterfly, but I kind of like this whole look. The religious symbols, like a lot of ancient creatures. I'm digging that one a lot. Don't know what that is. Looks like a cyborg thing with a compass. Of course, you got your tribal stuff. You get more kind of like, don't know what's happening. And I really like this one as well. Just not feeling there were the flowers. And then of course you got the wolf. Now these are smaller ones, as you can see. So these could like, you can also cut these out, of course. But these ones are like you put them back of your neck on the inside of your chest maybe on the leg right smaller ones so let's go through these now so this is what you get in this set so i recommend buying yourself a couple sets you know it's not gonna cost you a lot before you commit to getting a tattoo and walk around see how you feel see how people react to you having it and then if you want to get a real tattoo then get a real tattoo astrology signs are in this pack for example whereas the other packs don't have the astrology sign so that's kind of like an owl I really like that one I'm not sure about this call though because I want to incorporate my son's name the third eye I really like that one but I'm actually liking this one this is like a tribal thing I have a thing about Incas and Aztecs that's kind of neat too maybe I can put uh, my baby's face inside instead of that that goes that's like a barbed wire thing I'm really digging this one as well I, I like these the best. Now, in case you guys are wondering, a tattoo like that, this would be on your shoulder, for example, but you can kind of wrap it around on a half sleeve. You're looking at about five to $900 to actually get one of these tattooed in real life uh, because they're so realistic. Um, the cheaper ones like these, you can get for 40, 50 bucks if you find an artist, but it's the detail that um, costs a lot of money. All right, all right, so we're gonna be clicking this one. Now, all of these are mirrored. So very easy to do. First, you want to wipe the skin of any oil. So we just took a shower. If you have any additional hair, you probably want to shave it. In our case, we're going to be putting it right over here. This is kind of where I want it. So when I do this, you can see it. And I can still see his name um, as a reminder of the day. So I'm going to basically do it here. But we need to flip it, right? So we're going to be flipping it this way. Because it's going to be mirrored. And we can wrap it like this. Once this is here, we're going to take a sponge or some water or something. And we gotta soak this for 30 um, seconds, okay? But first, we need to remove this plastic film. So there's a plastic film on all of these. So we're gonna take this off. 
that's off and then now we're going to place this where we want it and you can already feel that it's sticking so when you put it that's when you're going to use the, the water to do it um, 20 to 30 seconds so i would keep it for like 40 seconds and slowly remove the paper and then that's that's all there is to it so let's do it remove the film put your arm out remember it's mirrored and then we're going to take this and likely do it like that. So now when this is on, this is when you want to put, it'd be nice if you had another person, but if you don't have another person, it's okay. Just rub this and take the water and then just wet it. And then it's slowly going to basically adhere. Hopefully, like they say 20 to 30 seconds right before it lets go. So just kind of go over it. You can see that here is, for example, it's not letting go, but it's already letting go on certain spots. I can see. Has it been 30 seconds yet? I don't know. But it's okay. Let's get a little more water. Pretty big. So, oh, see that it's already sliding off. Wow! Oh man, that looks so real. That looks so real. So now if I do this, okay, I definitely didn't put it in the right spot, in my opinion. I probably wanted it wrapped a little more, but it's definitely nice. We're gonna take a sponge and just dab it just a little more. So one thing I gotta say, so definitely, it looks definitely real. I definitely think people would be fooled. All right, so this is day three, and this is what it looks like. Actually, it has been, um, I've been itching for whatever reason so I probably scratched off some of it because it was itching me um, and this one is slightly peeling off you can see some of the little but from afar it still looks like a good tattoo what's going on so this is day five of the tattoos now the reason this one is coming off right over here you can see is because it's been about 40 degree weather and I'm wearing the gloves so the gloves are actually rubbing that off but all in all definitely durable